Today we're making mothers everywhere very, very happy. Hello everybody, I'm Mike Brooks from the Shape Your Future Healthy Kitchen with our good friend Chef Valerie from the OUTU School of Community Medicine. Mother's Day is here. We got the farmer's market going on and I love the sound of this. Yes. Strawberry salsa. Strawberry salsa. So you might have had a mango salsa or a peach salsa. Maybe you've had strawberry salsa before, but this is just beautiful, fresh, ripe strawberries that you can get at the farmer's market. And most all of these other things are available at the farmer's market okay. too. Herbs, great thing to get. So we're going to use some mint. You could also use so some good. cilantro. Mm -hmm. um, yes, you can already smell it. It does smell very good. So if you've never used mint before, so just take the stem and pull the leaves off and stack them up. And this is not precise. I mean, you could just take your knife and chop, 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 and that's fine. Um, but so I'm going to roll these a little bit and do what's called a chiffonade. So you don't have to get fancy and call okay. it a chiffonade. But mm -hmm. it's just little tiny strips. It means little ribbons, little teeny tiny strips of the mint. Okay. Again, so those are very pretty. But if you don't want to mess with that, chop, 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 chop. That's totally fine too. Okay. Not my version there. Okay. So yes. the mint, the mint is going right in. <laughs> A little pre-chopped mint here. Again, cilantro would be a great addition. Um, we have some jalapeno peppers. Add these as you like. If you oh, wow. cannot stand any spice at all, use a bell pepper. Use a red or a green bell pepper. Totally acceptable. Um, we're going to put just a, like a pinch of salt. And I say pinch, eighth to quarter of a teaspoon. Um, pinch of black pepper. So that's where you get your savory and sweet Ooh, together. Okay. And so that a little salt and a little pepper is really going to bring out the good flavor mm -hmm. in the strawberries. Whoopsie. And then we're going to do a little bit of lime juice. And again, if, these are very adaptable recipes. If you don't want to use lime juice and you only have white vinegar or apple cider vinegar, use that. Okay. Lime zest. So this is just the peel, the green from right. the outside. Mm -hmm. Okay. And so you can Use a zester or you can use the, the box grater that has the little teeth on the side. Mm -hmm. Great, great, great. Okay. And so then the next thing that we have is some red onion. Again, choose what you have already. If you have a yellow onion or a white onion or even green onion, totally fine. All of her recipes are so easy to remember because you can substitute this and that and it's, you're not particular. Yes. I mean, okay. we love the adaptability of that. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that's all stirred up, but I did want to back up just a tiny bit and show you on the strawberries. This is your secret. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so I see people cutting strawberries and they do this. That's and me. so that's you're totally me. wasting 20% of the strawberry. <laughs> and I really just hate to see that happen because strawberries can be a little bit pricey. So instead of doing that, use a paring knife and kind of just make a little circle around the strawberry stem. Uh -huh. Okay, you make just a little cone. I don't know if you can see that, but just a yeah. little cone shape. And then you're left with this much of the strawberry. And I mean, really having the strawberries would be enough, but I like to get a small dice for the salsa. Mm -hmm. Dice, dice. And so, look at that. Beautiful, super easy, and we didn't waste a giant top part of the strawberry. Good advice, yes. Okay. So again, adjust the acidity and the herbs to your liking, and then you can serve this with some maybe whole grain tortilla chips. This would be great with some bell pepper scoops, and of course, great on tacos. And you know, this really could be a side salad too. We call yeah. it a salsa, but it doesn't have to be a salsa necessarily. Oh, wait a minute. Okay. I forgot the beautiful we, oh, mint. See? So much better. Yes. And it smells so good. Yeah. And healthy. Very healthy. Good Kids stuff. will love this too. And old people like and me. And old people. Okay. All right. Well, thank you very much. This recipe and all the rest of our recipes on our website, kgrh.com. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you.